going to the jeweler, but the AP. Yeah, sliding on the water like a jet ski. Yeah. Hey guys, it's Janai. Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be really quick. I'm just here to explain something. So as you guys see, I have really short hair, and on my channel, that's what I do. I do hairstyles for you know women with short hair, just because it can be hard to be versatile when you feel like you don't have much to do with your hair so last month I posted about four different hairstyles that you can create using clip-ins even when your hair is really short ironically you know like a couple of days after I made that video Alyssa Ashley tweeted I don't remember what the exact tweet was but basically she was mentioning how hair companies are always asking her to promote their hair when she has no hair you know to attach the hair to and I was just like wow like that's really interesting because I just made a video about you know how you can wear clip-ins with your really short hair so I'm just here today to show you guys that your hair can be even this short and you can attach clip-ins to it now now I wouldn't recommend wearing clip-ins when your hair is this short because they can possibly fall out but I'm just showing you guys that your hair like doesn't really need to be a certain length especially if it's like kinky or coily like mine uh, to wear clip-ins. Of course you there are always other options like wigs and stuff like that But some of the styles that I created can't be achieved with a wig So that's the purpose of these videos So I have one of my clip-ins from her given hair that I used to make the videos This is the texture of it. It looks like really like puffy in the styles, but it's actually a um, spiral curl so I just got a haircut two days ago this is what it looks like and I'm gonna show you guys that I can still attach these clip-ins to my hair right here not right here just because like there is no hair right there but even though my hair is this short like you can see like some of my scalp I can still do it so there's no glue velcro or anything weird they're literally just clips okay some people were like oh can you zoom in like i'm gonna try and get the best view for you as i can i don't know if you guys can see how i did that but yeah okay so this looks you know kind of dumb or whatever right now but i'm just showing you guys that it can clip to my hair right now I can shake it, I can jump up and down, I can like, you know, do all of this and they're not going anywhere. I can flip it, you know what I'm saying, and they're not going to go anywhere. Okay. At this, at this, with my hair this short, I wouldn't necessarily tug on it, but like, when my hair was a little bit longer and I was like fluffing it and stuff and like doing this, like, it, it's not gonna go anywhere. Like I said, I would not recommend wearing them if your hair is this short, just because they can fall out, okay? They've never fallen out with me, just because I haven't worn them when my hair was this short, maybe like a little bit longer. If you go watch the videos, you'll see how long my hair is. But, um, yeah, I was just showing you guys that your hair can be short and you can still wear them. You can be versatile even when your hair is really short and you feel like you have nothing to do with it. And like I said, especially if you have coarser hair like I do, I have 4C hair. If you have very loose or even maybe straight hair or very loose curls, it may not work the same. I don't know. I can't talk for, you know, you guys who have looser hair. But I do know if you have short 4C hair like I do, you can do this. So everyone was so amazed or so confused, like, oh, what's it attaching to? It's attaching to my hair, believe it or not. Your hair doesn't have to be long to wear clip-ins. And yeah, I'm just here to show you guys that. So if you wanna see some of the styles that I achieved using clip-ins, I'll include them. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. And I'll see you guys in my next video, bye.